Oh, hey. Hi. <laughs> Can you even hear us? The AC is really loud. Um, I think... Oh. Don't tell Naomi. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh, <Diego>. Stop. <laughs> okay, we're really, really scared because we're in this hotel and... Basically what happened was we got here and the guy on the phone sounded really nice and I made the reservation over the phone and he was like, I'm not going to be there when you get there, but I'll leave the key in the mailbox. It's to the left of the door and just stood it out. You're in this room and blah, blah, blah. So we got here. There were some creepy guys standing outside. Claire Ann, not gonna hear this. Claire listen, I'm taking care of your kid, but <laughs> she's a fraidy cat. <laughs> Okay, so listen, so basically what happened was these creepy guys were standing outside. We opened the door. I was like, we're tired. We don't want to talk to you. Then he left us alone. We went inside. It was like a ghost town, quote unquote. (laughs) There was nobody here. Everything was closed up. Look alive, man. We We went to the Grand Canyon today, which is like, today was maybe not the best day that we've had yet. But, okay, so we couldn't get the door open to our room. There was nobody here. We had to walk past this, like, living room that had these, like, Raggedy Ann and Andy dolls. And just... I keep looking crazier. I'm sorry. Okay, Naomi, just don't pay attention to Naomi. She's just here for... (laughs) (laughs) Okay, so listen. No, come on. It's getting too long. Okay, okay. Okay, so then we couldn't get the door open. Then we finally got it open. It was just, like, a bed inside a room with a bathroom, like, down the hall. We were afraid. We were really afraid. You forgot about Raggedy Ann and Andy. I told you oh, weren't paying okay. attention. <laughs> okay, so then, then what happened was basically we then were afraid. Then the man called me back because I was calling him when we couldn't open the door, but he's not here. So he called me back and I was like, "We're having trouble with the door." Da da da. So he was like, and I was like, "Can we just take a different room? Is there another one?" He was like, "Tell you what, you could take room two o two." Just go behind the desk and get the key. So I went behind the desk of the hotel, picked the keys up for this room, and then we came in, and here, I'm going to just show you, like, this is, like, the mirror. This is, like, over there that, oh, oh, can you see me? I don't know what just happened. Something weird happened. We got too long. Uh Uh-oh. Anyways, okay, so that's the room. Here's the window. Here's the TV. I'm not walking over there. Anyways, so... Basically, then we went to eat at this diner, and I asked the waitress, like, what's the deal with this hotel? You know, we're staying there, and we're, like, kind of freaked out by it. Oh, because, oh, we're, when we walked up the stairs to get up to these rooms, there are these freaking holographs that look like portraits, but then it's a hologram, and half of it is, like, a skeleton. Like, it's, like, a like a lady this like this, cool. and then, shut up, and then when you get on the other side of it, it's, like, her bones inside like scary and on the phone I was like talking to the guy like listen I'm kind of scared like it's like abandoned here and da 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 and he was like it's fine those are meant to be kind of scary they're made by an artist for our hotel blah 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 so we get to the diner and this girl is like oh yeah well you know a lot of people like to stay there because of the history and stuff like that I was like don't tell me the history like I don't want to freaking know what happened in that place we're already scared whatever so then, of course, like two dumb idiots. Ooh, mad about you, Zon. Stop finishing. Um, so like two dumb idiots we asked, and she was like, well, you know, the people who owned it before, they died, and those are their pictures that are the holograms of dead people on the walls and da-da-da. And then like two even dumber idiots. Well, first of all, we got followed by some creepy guys <laughs> no, coming back here. Sure. Oh. And the girl no, was I like... about the pennies. Oh, she, she, the girl... Why don't you say... The girl said that they left the ghost leave pennies around. She said they don't do bad things, but that they are here and they're nice ghosts and they they didn't get murdered or anything. They just died. Anyways, we're scared. We almost threw up like multiple times out of like being afraid. And um, what else? And then we had to wait in this bar next door because this car was following us and it was kind of scary. And then now we're in the room, and we read all these reviews, which was also stupid, that were all, like... Well, first of all, also, the train goes by, like, every 30 minutes, like, right outside, and it's so loud, and for whatever reason, they toot the horn, like, blow the horn, like, right outside. And so they've taken the courtesy of including these earplugs for us. (laughs) So we'll be using these. Well, I'm going to use them. She's not because she's afraid. I'm too scared to not hear 
I don't want to hear because we read reviews about children running around when there aren't children staying here and noises about people running around and anyways we're afraid and whether I talk about it or not it, it's probably going to happen so <laughs> we're really afraid we might not sleep and we're going to Las Vegas tomorrow we have a nice cushy place to stay so we can't wait, we can't wait to get there and this room may have only been $30 but we should have stayed in Motel 6 I don't know if that's true. I don't know if that's true. But if we live till tomorrow. Yeah, post this tonight. So yeah, I'm posting it tonight. Up. If we live till tomorrow, we'll have a good story. Or this is a good story. If we don't, then... By the way, this light flashing on me, that's the TV. That's not a ghost right now. Okay? So anyways, we're afraid. We're like... Very peeing afraid. ourselves afraid like every like we're like my heart is pounding yep. like I'm, t- I'm terrified <laughs> anyways so six minutes long and um until That's next it. time this is us hopefully we'll see you again yeah hopefully okay. we'll see you guys again bye